work, work, work. Let me see you work, work, work. Pot it. I like the way you pot it. Pot it. All right, what's up, man? Uncle motherfucking Spill Spill DTV, man. I'm coming out my high eighties on these interviews. She had to pull up on my nigga, motherfucking Supreme, nigga. So hey, you, with it. Uh, you might know him on IG as Bob motherfucking McGriff, man. Manager or straight now. You know what I'm talking about? What's up, baby? What's up, Uncle Spill? Man, shit, man. Where, where the fuck we at, man? Ah, uh, man, right now we in the uh. You know what I'm saying? This is a, a designated and secluded area of, of somewhere in Florida. Somewhere in Florida, Feel man. Me? Hey, we got motherfucking palm trees and shit, man. Yeah, what the man. fuck going you know on around right here? You know, we got it working. Hey, man, shit. Yeah. Hey, so, you know, a lot of people, um, you know, some people know, a lot of, and, and, and a lot of people don't know. I'm, I'm speaking to the younger generation. They don't know how important you are to this. Uh, uh, Texas music scene, yeah. or uh, especially the Fort Worth music yeah. scene. You know what I'm talking about? For sure. Uh, uh, we gon' we gon' uh, you was uh, the one. You was the first manager to go yeah yo, correct? Oh, for sure. Okay, okay, yeah. okay. Um, after go yeah yo, who 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 else you had after that? After yeah yo, I had a cat named J O. J O. Yeah, J O was fly too. J.O. Well, J.O. kind of had a similar uh, uh, rhyme cadence as uh, Yayo, right? No, 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 not no. at all. Okay, okay. Yeah, totally same from Fort Worth, but totally different. Okay, what was the difference by, by, by J.O.? J.O. was more on some um, kind of like singing, melodic, all that shit they doing now. Yeah. Like he been doing all of that. Oh, he was on that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. And w what year was this? J.O. probably like 2017, you know what I'm saying? Maybe going into 18 a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Now the Yayo. Yeah. When, when did you and Yayo relationship start? Um, it started uh like in 2015. Uh, friend of friend of the family, friend of mine. You know what I'm saying? Um, she 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 mentioned Yayo. You know what I'm saying to me. Okay. You feel me? And, uh, you know when she brought him to me in Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? We hit it out. That was my little partner. That was my little nigga. You feel me? That was my, you know. That's what that was, and, and that's how that happened. It wasn't like, I can honestly say that Yayo was like, uh, like a lot of this stuff going on right now, not just in Texas, but just in the music game period. Like, uh, like Go Yayo, he, you know what I'm saying? He, he had his hands in it. Like a lot of them people watched him. You try to sound like another region, you know what I'm talking about? Like some of these new rappers, they sound like they from Fort Worth. You know what I'm talking about? These niggas sound like they from Fort Worth, nigga. Y'all niggas ain't from Fort Worth, man. Sound like where you from, nigga. If you from North Carolina, South Carolina, sound like you from there, nigga. Nigga, don't be sound like you from Fort Worth, like you motherfucking go, yeah, yo. Boo got a casino, CJ Casino, Kenny B and all them niggas. Sound like you. This oh, I'm gonna say this, man, on some real shit. Hey. A lot of the, a lot of the, 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 the flow that's going around Texas, the, a lot of the flow that's going around other cities in this nation. I'm gonna be honest with you, man. The first nigga I heard rapping like that was Go Yeah Yo. Square Billy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Now, this is the question I have. How the fuck did the rap cadence in that that Fort Worth? That first word, that Fort Worth swag, that first, that Fort Worth sauce, leave the stockades and go to other goddamn cities, the uh, other cities. Man, um, you know a lot of that stuff when you a trendsetter, when you doing something that people like and they and they feel a certain kind of way about you, you can't help but that. You feel me? So we had um, when it happened, we 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 peeped it and we was. We was happy about it. It was flattering. You know what I'm saying? Um, but you know, it was something that we 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 didn't try to pay attention to because it it would make it would make us feel a certain kind of way. But how it get out and go everywhere else is because shit, that shit was spreading, man. You know what I'm saying? Like like you 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 know that's what that was. A lot of them dudes, man. Like a lot of them dudes, man. A but whole bunch of people. But let's keep it real. You know, it could be flattering to a certain to a certain extent. Yeah. To, to you know because you know it's flattering at first but to a certain extent especially when cats ain't shot out 
She can't sing paying oh, homage. See, now, and right now, what's going on? Yeah. Oh, it's not. It ain't flattering no more. It's disrespectful now. Yeah, it's damn near like low key disrespectful. You know what I'm saying? Cause. Like you said, ain't no shout out, ain't no, ain't no paying homage. You ain't even gotta pay homage, you know what I'm saying? But like, and you ain't gotta shout out a particular person yeah. when you when it comes to that. But say where it came from, like say the city, say the, you know, give some kind of thing as to where you picked that up from, whether it's from YouTube or if you came to the city and, and got some of the flavor. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like you're supposed to go in and in in you know soak up some and you know do go back when you do what you do, but you also supposed to respect the game. Yeah, you know what I'm saying, and that's what these niggas not doing. They're not respecting yeah. the game. They're not paying homage. I mean, these people all. culture votes in Fort Worth that's right in the same damn metroplex. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah, straight up, straight like that. Yeah, it's like that. Yeah. God damn, nigga, that's crazy. Now you know something. I'm gonna say one thing, man. And, 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 and this and during my introduction, this is why I say I called you the manager of short now, because a lot of managers, so-called managers, yeah. You can find the, you can find that first artist, but can you bounce back? Yeah. You nigga, you bounce back three motherfucking times. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. What's the secret sauce? What's the secret recipe on you bouncing back like that, man? Because you know Jay Z, you know Jay Z had a a, a, a hard ass bar where you know it's a it's a legendary bar where he shot a slug at Dame Dash. It said motherfuckers talking about they made hoes, make another hole. Another hole. Yeah. I mean. Shit, with me split man like i ain't never got a game of black eye and that's shit, we, we doing this music so you know what i'm saying i just looked at it like it was anything else and yeah. like all the artists i work with you know what i'm saying can nobody ever say supreme was on no fuck shit supreme was on no stealing shit supreme was on no trying to be bigger than the artist shit. nobody will ever say that about me yeah. so after you do it once and it's like okay that's all right that's cool all right yeah yeah it was big time though you know what i'm saying um, then you come back again and you know, J.O. was like Rock Nation wanted J.O. It's some old like mother shit, you know what I'm saying? Then you come back again with Kenny B and shit, Kenny was, you know, so it's like, it ain't no, and it wasn't no particular thing I did with any of them. It wasn't no, it ain't no blueprint, ain't no particular amount of money I spent. We want on no gay shit. We want acting weird or different than what we act always, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna, get, um, I'm gonna be, I'm, I'm gonna keep it all the way gangster with you. And I don't know, I don't know if Kenny B gonna watch this interview, but I'm gonna say this: when Kenny B was at his livest, it's when he was with you. Yeah, for sure. That's facts. Yeah. That is, this ain't no dick. This ain't no. This ain't really no eating dick or nothing. This is real shit. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? If you even look at it, his biggest song to date was Perkins. I was in the truck, I'ma smoke for a week. Only a week, yeah. The blunt's big as me. Geek, I gotta be low like Chinese. Stop dicking her throat, tell that bitch sneeze. Hot as younger, yeah. I need a breeze. Pass me the. We was, we was all in the studio together. <laughs> we, was, we was in New York. Yeah. Same studio that Tupac got shot in. You know what I'm saying? That's what we Quad was. Quad Studio. Dave East was around the, in the other next room. Yeah. Yeah. Man. Nah. The Asian dog was there too. What happened? What, what, what situation with you and Kenny B? Uh, we cool. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. So basically, y'all just decided to uh, split ways, or what? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now, if it, if it was if it was ever opportunity for you to work with Kenny B, if Kenny B came at you and say, "Hey, Supreme, I want to work with you again," would would you uh, do that? We have to sit down and talk about a few things, but I entertain any, you know, you know what I'm saying, as long as it makes sense. You yeah. know what I'm saying. Okay, See, okay. cause this thing did like, like, like with this music thing, you know, it could, it, it, it could change your life. You know what I'm saying? Either way, you want your life changed, mm -hmm. but it's, it's not really real. So I never take personal vendettas with, with, with people that I once cared for, loved, or you know what I'm saying? However that is, you know, I never go that far with it because it's not real. Yeah. And you, and you might not really feel how you think you feel about me. Yeah. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah. So yeah, like. All right, so can it be? Can it, can it be when it's separate ways? Uh, his separate way. Uh, you know, you, you had you uh, you had Swerve Lord. Uh, then you went and found the little uh, R&B little uh, sensation man with Von D. Yeah, Von D. You know what I'm sure. saying? Fuck me like you miss me. You ain't been answering my messages. Now you wanna hit me. Talking, baby, where you been? Cause you ain't been with me. 
Now you think I got all type of friends Trippin', trippin', trippin' over you Yeah Von D basically, he's doing something that nobody is trying to do right now And that's bring R&B back Yeah You know what I'm saying? He dropped a uh, 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 he dropped a viral motherfucking hit. Nice I, me. I say it's viral. Yeah. Cause it's hard for an ind you think you you, uh, you rappers think it's hard for an independent rapper to have a hit. Think about how hard it is for an independent R and B singer. Coming from Fort Worth, man, it's heavy populated. The the not even don't even single out Fort Worth. Coming from the DFW, that's a heavy populated rapper. It's um, rap heavy. That's, why, that's all it is, man. Yeah. And it's kind of low key, like gangster rap, like, you know, whatever you call it. And he come singing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So. What made you, what, like, what made you want to roll the dice and say, hey, man, I'm going to fuck with this R&B nigga? You know, Vaughn, that's like my little brother. Okay. So he was already around me, you know what I'm saying? And um, I knew he could do music, but mm -hmm. I didn't know how dope he was. I didn't know he was that dope, mm -hmm. but I saw. You know, from working with the other artists in the past, like I've, I've, I've gotten, um, you know, you got to pay attention to certain things and you pick up on it when you've been around it. Yeah. So I knew he had something that I've seen before, you know, and then he dope, like his music is dope. You know what I'm saying? So, and there, you know, was, shit, you seen what he did? Oh yeah. You know, just what, what, what missed me right now is what? It's, I know, I, I, I already know he's like 80 or something. 80k right now. Right yeah. now? Okay. R and B straight. R and B. Yeah. Straight. straight R and B. Shit show. On half paint film. Yeah. Hey, so uh, he dropped a new single right now. Love letter. Yeah. Love, love letter. letter. Too, yeah. You told so. me somebody. Who, who was that? You said was fucking with that love letter. Um. You said it was like Rick James. Oh yeah, Rick James' daughter. That's yeah. her, like her, that's her shit right now. The love letter. Yeah. She fuck with Mitch me, but love letter is like her favorite song right now. That's live as fuck, yeah. man. You know what I'm talking about. So we got, so Preen, Preen, Preen went, 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 went from, so this this the tree we, we working with y'all. That's why we call this man the Fort Worth legendary manager, man. We got, we got Go Yo Yo, we got J-O. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, we, oh well, let's not forget, stop six low key, right? That's my partner, ain't he finna get out? Yeah, for shit you know show. All right, we went to Kenny B. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? I fuck with Kenny B. I like, I, hey, Kenny B. Uh, we we gotta get you back on track, man. Straight up, Jack. <laughs> man, you're a star, baby. But you gotta, hey, hey, you can't do it by yourself, man. It takes a team, baby. It's like, it's like that old African proverb, man. It takes a village to raise, baby. You can't do it by yourself. But anyway, so we can it be. We got Von D. Now, you fucked all the heads up. And you, <laughs> when you went, hey, so you 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 fucked them up with the R and B. Now you went you went the female route. Oh, they yeah. found you a female artist with K fucking breezy, man. Oh yeah. Hey breezy. Hey breezy. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I want to back this shit up. I want to back right. it up. All right. This ain't no disrespect. This ain't no slug to nobody, but. What made you, cause we, we, it was another young female rapper that had a buzz out there that you had an opportunity to work with. Can we, can we say her name? All right, Saucy Bowler. All right, so what made you, like any other, any other person probably would have chose Saucy Bowler. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because she had the buzz, she had the Instagram popularity, all that shit, you know what I'm saying? K Breeze was kind of, she was, she was known, but she was more underground known. Mm -hmm. What made you, Say now, nah, you know, I wanna fuck with Breezy. Um, I had already I had already um knew about Breezy, you know what I'm saying? The the universe the universe aligned me and Breezy together. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Okay. And and how the universe lined you up? So we found each other. Okay. You know, I was checking her out and she was already like like checking me out at the same time. So okay. when when we connected like I already, I had a feeling about her. I was like, I, I, and I told her like, this, like you gonna do something. I didn't know when or how, I just had a feeling. Yeah. And, and then shit, you fast forward, you know what I'm saying? It was like, we was already, we already used to talk like, if not every day, every every few days, you know what I'm saying? Before we was even working. And shit, it was just like an easy transition. Like that's like family, you know? And shit, 
So basically, it's a rap, it was more of a personal relationship. Oh with yeah. Y'all. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha, gotcha. But it's, it's it's also business too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But we do we do personal business. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah. On a family tip. That's yeah. That's how we get in. That's what that is. On some loyalty type shit. Oh yeah. 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 Straight up. All right. So Breezy got this the the fucking viral fucking hit. And they, it's pop that nigga. Oh yeah. Like nigga, I didn't know niggas was doing a pop that. I was watching niggas doing the pop that and didn't even know they, they was doing the shit. You know yeah, what I'm talking about? Yeah. It's like it's like the hottest dance in Texas right now. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? So, you know, she got she got what is is what where's that? Eight hundred K? Yeah. No promo? Nah. No push? Nah. Organic. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah. It's so organic that she's getting booked and selling out the motherfucking clubs. Oh yeah. You know what I'm talking about? Okay, Breezy the hottest artist. She the hottest artist in the DFW right now. Right I said now. artist. I ain't say female. I said artist. Artist. Ooh. And she's she's hold she, up, hold up. To back that shit up, nigga. So you what? saying artist. You saying she hotter than some of these niggas too. Oh, yeah. Ooh. I mean we got we, we got receipts and we Ooh. and we got, you know, she back it up. You know, Ooh. Ain't <laughs> Man, yeah. you niggas need stuff, y'all but You niggas didn't get in the studio, man. Hey, K Breezy in the motherfucking on the laptop right she now listening to the beats yeah, right, right now. now like, why, she, why you niggas over here at the club, motherfucking spinning your dubs? Hey man, motherfucking hey, hey, K, hey, K Breezy trying to sell out the she motherfucking like a club. Young Mike Tyson, man. Oh, why you say that? She she just wanna train. Yeah. Go 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 in the ring and do her thing. Yeah. And then get back to the stain. Yeah. You feel me? <laughs> There ain't no, oh, no, it ain't no man. hanging. You know oh, what I'm no. saying? Hey, man, motherfuckers are free with the with the Uncle Spliff rhyme, man. Yeah. Oh, I feel that, man. It's live as fuck. No, man, but so really, the, uh, K Breezy, K Breezy's uh, success has has uh, caught the the attention of other people in oh, the yeah. industry. Oh yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, for 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 can 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 we speak on that, or you want to kind of keep on the hush? Hey. Uh, we ain't got to keep it on the hush, but you know, like, you know, we don't do that anyway, so we ain't finna do it for the camera. Yeah, okay, you okay. Know? All right, so, um. They, they go see it and They go see it anyway, yeah, okay. They, they see it right now, but. Well, right now, uh, I guess, one, you know, Florida. We the Florida. I mean, we, we ain't from Florida. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We, and, you, and we in Florida right now. Yeah, we out here doing business. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Doing what? Business, man. Oh, shit. You hear me? God damn, man, motherfucking supreme, man. Hey, right, so uh, supreme. So um, right now, so you really trying to um, you you, uh, you started off as a manager in the music industry, yeah. but right now you trying to more uh, form a record label right now or what? I mean, yeah. Cause I know you, I, I I saw I saw you you uh, you start promoting the you, with your new logo, the company. The company. Yeah. Yeah. The company is um, you know what I'm saying. I just like. Me and my boy, Jay that, you feel me? We came up with it like, it was just like the, I was in LA, you know what I'm saying? I was just sitting back, just, you know, enjoying myself. And I was like, you know, the, it's the company you keep, like, you know, the company. Yeah. So I just like shit, the company, you know what I'm saying? So now it's the company and it's NOF, you know what I'm saying? Nothing over family. That's okay. what it is, you dig what I'm saying? It, the company, NOF, NOF, the company, however you want to chop it up, it's all the same. You dig what I'm saying? Uh, like. Yeah, I'm a manager, but I, I've kind of then morphed into something else. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I don't really like have a, I wouldn't put just a title on it like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just do, I do what I need to do. Like, to make shit pop. Yeah. I like that. So. Sure. Well, well, Uncle Spliff, I don't want to leave nobody out, man, because I fuck with him too. But also, you also had, uh, you, you also has touched the career a swear a swear lord too, right? Oh yeah, shout out swear lord. Yeah, shout yeah. out to swear man. Fat Mac, you know what I'm saying? Um, who all with the who like who's all right currently right now? Right now, the yeah. company consists of myself, J Dad Designs. We got King Cuts, Dorsey down in Atlanta. It's a master barber. Mm -hmm. um, K Breezy the Great, Von D, Fat Mac. DJ Drayski, okay. Wise G the Enterprise, you know what I'm saying? Lil Chris, that's the producer. Yeah. You dig what I'm saying? Um, shit, that's 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 the you know, A Tony Films is the videographer. 
all of these people you you can get in contact with. Hey, Tony so, Films, what what videos he shot? She just she just shot the pop thing. Oh ho 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 ho! You say she? Yeah, hey Tony is a female. Oh, it's a female. Oh yeah, for sure. Okay, Dallas, Texas. Okay, she shot. She By shot way of Mississippi. Okay, huh? she shot pop that. What else she shot? She just shot the um the rock alpha K Breeze. She's like K Breeze. Nah, but talking about the the, the Missy Elliott looking type oh, yeah. shit. She, she shot, shot that, that shit. Yeah, for sure. Oh yeah. nigga, she ooh half pint. You better watch out, nigga. Yeah. You better step the motherfucking video skills up. Hey man, God, she shot that shit, bro. Yeah. Who shot Who shot Von D shit? Uh, lost footage. Grim. He hard too. Oh yeah, he's super hard. Yeah, he fucking hard, yeah, bro. Yeah, he hard. I'm Grim probably that. New York right now shooting some videos or something. Straight like that. Yeah, yeah. All right, so what's uh, what's next for what's next for for Supreme and, and the company, man? Oh man, we just really pushing this um, really pushing this K Breezy thing right now, man, and it's Von D. Um. And just you know, better in ourselves. That that's what we do every day. So right now she's a priority right now. Oh, for sure. Okay, okay. okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hey, how about this, man? This, you know, we know we 